Hello, good good afternoon. Can you hear me? <clears throat> yes, I can hear you. Yes. How many are here? Three. Yes. Okay. Yes, uh, no, yes. Last? Oh, yes, just to do. Sorry. Yes, it was Mandy, right? Mandy, what did I ask you to do? Well, first, uh, uh, number 48, 49, 3 and 4. What for 48 and 49, right? Yeah. Okay. While waiting for the others, I will check what book first. 48, 49. Oh. Okay, I won't let you read that because very similar to the story from course book. Those who are late, page 48, what book? I am going to start page 49, number 3. Look at the magazine article in exercise one again and answer the questions. That one. Are you ready? Find you number one. Read the questions first. How do Richard try to protect the animal before the before he invented the flying lights? How did Richard try to protect the animals before he invented the lion life? Hello. Hello. Hmm. Uh, uh, use fire and make scarecrow protect the animal from the lion. Oh. Where is it? Uh, I see two uh two idea. Uh, first one is uh, yeah. uh, uh, his first, first paragraph. Part, first uh, paragraph. First paragraph. Third line. Yeah. Third line, his first idea was used fire, to, use, to fire. use fire. So the question says, how did Richard try to protect the animals before he invented the light, lion light? So he used fire, fire. right? Yes. yes. He uh, tried to protect the animals by using fire. And another one? Uh, um, to... Uh, page number eight. Oh, no, no, no. Past paragraph line eight. Hmm. Uh, his idea, his next idea was to make a scarecrow to make the lion. Yes. So by making, by, by using fire and making a scarecrow, right? You need to change a little bit according to the question. Okay. 
everybody check check your answer the first one by using fire the second one by making escape by making escape crew is it correct okay Jose Acho, number two why didn't Richard's first idea work? Uh, because it had the lion to see the color in the cow sheep. Yes, correct. It helped the lion to see the cattle in the cow shed. Yes, you are right. Where, where is your answer? Where is your answer? I <clears throat> number six. Yeah, first paragraph, line number six. You can get the answer, right? Yes, you are right. And the answer is like, it helped the lions to see the turtle in the cow shed. That is for number two. Go to number three. I'll can you, I'll can you, are you okay? Number three question, I'm doing workbook. What is the word for cows kept on a farm? How do we call the, the, the cows kept on a farm? Hmm? Yeah. Yeah. Cow shed. Huh? That is the place. Cow shed is the place. I want the word for cow. Another word for cow. Hmm? Cattle. The answer is cattle. Cow shed is the place where cows are kept. But you are asked the cow. Kept on a farm. You are not asked the place. So the answer is cattle. Do you see cattle? Yes. In the first paragraph. Yes. Uh, see the cattle. It have the lion to see the cattle. Yes, correct. Here the cattle, the cattle. So it is the answer is the cattle. Can you follow the cattle? Okay, let's go on. Number four. Number four. Uh, what's wrong with the girls? Oh, yeah. Ben. Ben, are you with me? Number four. Yeah. Why what didn't books? Richard... Yes, what book? I'm checking mm -hmm. homework. This one, this one. This page. Page number 49, everybody. Uh, number four? Yes. Why did uh, Richard's second idea work? Because the lion realized the scarecrow wasn't really a real person. Yes. Where is it? Uh, it's... It's the... In the... In the... Twelve. First paragraph, yes. Um, you can see the paragraph. They, they realized the scarecrow wasn't a real person because it didn't move. You need to reach near the scarecrow, right? Because the question is related to that. Mm -hmm. Number five. Me, 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 Nadi. Yeah. Why did hmm. this? Why did his third idea work? Work because lions are afraid of moving light. Yes, the lions were scared of a moving light. Afraid of moving light. Where is it, Minadi? It's uh th three th second paragraph and third line from the bottom 
actually the first paragraph is too big. It is not second paragraph. It is first paragraph. And last part. Everybody look at the last part. He discovered that the lions were scared of a moving light. Okay. And who is who do you think? Are you with me? Who do you think? Can I ask you? Yes. Okay. Uh, I want to know this one. Why did Richard need an Oka battery? It's uh, for electricity. What is it? Uh, second paragraph, first line. Mm, it, is, it is partly correct. He used a solar panel to produce electricity and he connected it to an old car battery, which stored the electricity. So, uh, you can make it longer. Can, can you say, I will ask someone else. And you can compare your answer. Minadi, how about how about number six? Tell me your answer. Mm, an old car battery is necessary to store the electricity. Mm -hmm. You could not neglect that part. You know, you need to say to store the electricity for what? That part is to store the to store electricity. That is more important, right? You are talking about a solar panel. It is to produce electricity, and he connected. It means a solar panel is related uh, connected to an O car battery. So you are asked O O car battery. So you can say like needed needed an O car battery to store the electricity. Okay, number seven. I go you number seven. Why did Richard need an indicator box from a motor bike? Yeah, I'm not finished. Seven, eight. Oh, number seven. He hasn't arrived yet. Ben, see. Uh, the indicator box made the flash on and off. Indicator box, where is your answer? Uh, in second paragraph. Second column or first column? Second column. Mm -hmm. Second column, you can see the indi indicator box. Third line, what does it say? The indicator box made the light flash on and off. Yes, correct. So to make the lights flash on and off. You can see it that way. So through the questions, you need to read carefully. Okay, you could see the indicator box. In the question, it says indicator box. So you need to read. Where do you see indicator box? Second column, first. Second column, first paragraph. The indicator box made the lights. So what the a question is? Richard needed an. Oh, sorry. Richard needed an indicator box from a motorbike to make. Right, change a little bit to make the lights flash on and off. Frank, do you understand? Yes. Okay, number eight. Uh, answer. Think of think of a title book for the magazine article. The whole the whole passage. You must give your own title. Do you have an idea for the title? The okay. Who wants to give the title for this story? What is the main idea? Uh, protecting towns from a lion. I, I will write it down. Towns? Only towns? Yeah. Farm animals? Animals, yeah. Yeah, farm animals. It would be better. Protecting farm animals 
from the line. Or, uh, from predators. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Good ideas. Any different opinion? If it is acceptable, I will put it on the share screen. Any Inshallah. other title? May not you say? Mine is Invention of Richard Lion White. Yes, it is also acceptable. Because I thought that the whole paragraph is all about Lion Light. About Lion Light, yeah. That is also ideal. So, uh, Richard's what? I will put Richard at the front. Richard's. Hmm? Mina DC again, Richard's what? Invention of Richard's Lion Light. Mm, you can put you mean like that? Mm, yeah. Yes, they are possible. And the second one is more suitable in my point of view. But the first one is also okay. And the whole one is about about lion light. So in your in the topic, if you put lion light, it is better. The invention of Richard's lion light. Or you can put as to lion lights. Yeah, they are possible top titles for the magazine article. And number four, you must be able to catch the main ideas. Sometimes in the exam, you will be asked that way, note taking the key points. And let's discuss together. Number four, problem. Key facts in the magazine article, problem. Uh, tell me problem. What do I have to write for problem? Make it short. What what blogs? Uh, lions in the village, uh, animals in village. Hmm, correct. So the problems: lions eat the farm animals. From where? Uh, in village. Yeah, farm is village. The farm animals. There is in a fine a farm and yeah animals. So Richard's first idea. He or he just arrived. My go view, how about Richard's first idea? Uh use fire to protect the cows from lion or the lion. Okay. Use fire. Use fire, yes. Or using fire, it is also using okay. Fire. This empire. How can you? How about second idea? Hello. So the other day. Hi. Ah, uh, to make scale. To make the scale. Yeah, making make a scarecrow. They are possible. Make a scarecrow. Third idea. Ben, third idea. Uh, make a lion light. Hmm. How more materials and devices used? Show the other thing. Uh, I haven't finished yet. Hmm? Um, Minadi, can you say which materials and devices used? Okay. Solar panel, mm -hmm. a battery, a transformer, a bulb from a torch. Solar panel, 
And after that, yeah, and Oka battery, correct? And a transformer. And also he found an old indicator box from a motorcycle and connected this to the battery. So another um, one is transformer. That, that, it, does it say transformer? Yeah, it's the same, I guess. He also connected the indicator box, which he called a transformer. Yes. So you could say like um an old indicator box. An old indicator box. That is what he called. But the main one is in an old indicator box. An old indicator box. And what else? A box from a torch. A, yeah, a, a box. Uh, and all touch and all touch and all touch G-O-S-H touch and all touch hmm. correct and result Research pen. Result. Uh, Success. Do I need to give a reason? Uh, oh, no, no. I, I want to know the result. What are you going to write for result? Uh, okay. The result is the lion thing that someone was walking around the township preventing the animals, so they stay away. The result stayed away. Which, uh, it is not meaningful. And look at, you need to take the words from second column. First paragraph, last part. The flashlights made the lions think that someone was walking around the cow shed protecting the animals, so they stay away. So the main idea is like the lions stayed away because you can see that we change the sentence pattern a little bit. The lions stayed away. If you use past tense, all must be past tense. If you use present tense, use past present tense. And because you can change the flashlights, made the lions think blah blah blah. Go that way. You must know how to take notes. Up to that, did I ask you to to do number five? No. No, three and four. No. Okay, I I will teach you first. So. Uh, that is all for homework. So, okay. Mm. So, so, let me drain water, please. Let me drain. Yeah, sure, sure. Okay. To do okay, I will do course book. I want to continue. First book, uh, page 65-66. Let's do 
um, we have already discussed Richard's story. Did we finish number four, by the way? Course book, everybody, page 65. I want to start with, I want to start with page 65. Number four, is it finished? No. Oh, yeah. I think I let you do homework, Bank of You. Did I? Did you do homework? No. No. Yeah, it's me. Number four, everybody, answer the questions. There are four questions. You need to read the passage. Find the answer for one to four. How does Richard's early life relate to his ambitions now? Exam, IGCC exam questions are like that. You need to try to understand it and change. For some answers, you have to change a little bit with your own English. Own, with your own words, right? One to four. Read the passage okay. again. Answer the question. Do you know what to do? Yes. No, dear. Explain me. Like, where? Oh, oh. Wait. First of all, please open page 65. This page. Can you see my share screen? Page number, please. 65. Oh, yeah. You are supposed to look at 64. Reading passage is there. I am doing number four. Oh, number yes. three is already finished. Number yeah. four, there are four questions. You need to look at the answers by reading the passage from Richard to reread in Vandash. Two, one to four. We will do this and I'll come back.
Okay, I think it is enough. One to four. Are you ready? The continuation, the continuation of yesterday lesson. Number one, how does Richard's early life relate to his ambitions now? Hosea uh, John. How will you answer for that? Uh, he's not here. Uh, oh. So, how does Richard's early life relate to his ambitions now? The funny is when we like. They are related, related connected. That's sad. That's sad. Yes, we. Richard. What is his early life? Where did he live? Uh, Tell me about his early life. Uh, I saw the Naruto National Park in Kenya. Hmm? That is he, the project. place where he lives. I mean, his early life. By the way, how about his ambitions? Uh, we should, uh, using all household documents and match. Okay. By the way, what is the meaning of ambition? You must know the meaning of ambition so that you can give the proper answer. Minadi. How does Richard's early life relate to his ambitions now? What is the meaning of ambitions? Ambition is your goal, your dream, your destination. Yes. So here, what is his ambitions? What are his ambitions? Mm, he wants to be an engineer and a lab. Yes. The last part. Now I want to be an engineer and a pilot. So that is, these are the ambitions. Right? These are his yes. ambitions. Engineer. So, and uh, how about his early life? Hello, okay, Oh, hi. Oh, Okay, okay, okay. His early life. Okay, okay, okay. Minadi, his okay, early life. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Um, he, he has been always fond of creating things out of old household appliances since he was little. Mm. In the first part of the passage, look at the first paragraph. He has always enjoyed making things using old household appliances and machines. You see that? That is his early life. Good. The question says, how does Richard's early life relate to his ambitions now? So, Menadi, if you were asked in the exam, how would you write? Right. How would um, you write in your own words? He, okay. He has always been fond of creating things out of old household materials and machines since she was very little. So now he wants to be an engineer in an engineer, yeah. Mm -hmm. So now when he grew, I'm sorry. So now when he grows up, he wants to be an engineer. Mm. Uh, sometimes for how, you can use because. You can use because. Because. He has always enjoyed making things using old household appliances. You can see that. Appliances and machines. And he, he wants to be an engineer and a pilot. 
you can join with ANDN. Ambitions means want to be, right? He wants to yeah. be. Number one and some must be like that. Because take some sentences from the first part and he wants to be an engineer and a pilot. Number two, why is Richard's ambition good for man and nature? Ben. Good for man and nature. Where do you see that information? Man, uh, it means people, right? Yeah. So I write it on my word. Of course. You need to okay. use your own words. Uh, uh, in proper way. The cow, because the cow was killed by the lion, so it's good for farmer and animal. So the cow wasn't extinct uh, because of the lion. And the lion doesn't care by the farmer because uh, they are protecting the the, the pounds from the lion. Where is that information? Um, which it's fifth paragraph, I think. Second column. Yeah. Yes, you could see that information there. I will read out second second paragraph, second column. Richard Lyons lights cost just ten dollars to make. They have not only helped the farmers, but also the lions. Many lions have been killed by farmers trying to protect their animals. So the lion lights don't kill the don't kill the lions. So it is in some way, it can help the um, uh, nature, all right? And how about man? It doesn't cost, so it means it helped the farmers. Many people could afford. And another thing is that, go further down, across Kenya, Richard's idea has been adopted by farmers to protect the animals from predators and to protect their crops from elephants. Yeah, you need to take the ideas from from that paragraph. So it's sure. good. Yeah, see. Um, could I say it's one win situation at the end of the sentence? Could it be? Of little... course, of course. It is one one situation. Can I write it down in exam? Um. Yes, of course you can. But right. you need to explain a little bit before you write that. Give yes. explanation. All right. And you could take some ideas from second paragraph. Pan's answer is based on the second paragraph. Lion, light, lion lights have not only helped the farmers, but also the lions. Because many lions have been killed by farmers trying, trying to protect their animals. All right. That is the main point protest the animals and their crops. You can take some words from the from the last sentence. Otherwise, the paragraph, the answer will be very long. Do you understand? So it is one win-win uh, situation. Do you understand number two? Yes. Do you know what to write? The answer is quite long. Take some words from second column, second paragraph. You can use your own words too. You can summarize. You must know how to answer. Go to number three. Why is Richard's invention such a good idea? It's a good idea. Sometimes you can repeat the answers according to the question. Pull the door. Number three, Richard's idea, uh, Richard's invention is such a good idea because, or oh, you can start with because. Why is, why is it a good idea? 
Oh, oh, oh my God. No, no. What the hell is going on? Thank you, then. Would you like to try? Uh, because farmer can protect protect the animals from white animals. Mm -hmm. uh, how about energy? Your answer, please, for number three. <laughs> okay. Because it cost very little, mm -hmm. so that everyone can afford it. It so so you just. Summarize, summarize the previous answer. It is okay. So you just cover only one point. I want, I want you to cover both. Both. Mm -hmm. It's a set. It's a good idea because. Um, almost every farmers can afford it, and the the predators are not killed anymore. Like mm. the predators are not killed. So I I would take the points from the previous answer again because actually you are repeating the previous answer. The previous answer, the same idea. And you, you can use your own words and you can make it short because the farmers could afford to um, uh could afford to buy the lion. To make lion lives as it is not costly and the lions are not not killed killed anymore yeah are not killed by the farmer so it is understood so the lions are not killed that is also okay so uh, number and... two number two and three quite similar okay say say then say what do you want to say yeah I'm not the same as it, so let um, Yeah, yeah, see. What do you want to say? Uh, because uh, it's helped to the world's nature. Today, many animals went extinct for some, because of some reason. Uh, one of the reasons is they kill each other to eat and to alive. Now, Russia create lions and lions, so it's great for lions and cows. They didn't die anymore. Mm. It's quite similar. Your answer must be based on the reading test. Yeah. Don't don't go beyond that much. Your answer is quite similar to mine. In the second part, second passage, you your answer must be based on the second paragraph, second column. You can make it short. Starting from you know, lion lives cost just ten ten dollars up to they are crops from elephants that make it short. The ideas must be from that paragraph. Can you do it? Yes, I can do it. Yeah, yeah. It is concerned with your writing skills. If you could summarize all the points with few words, it's better. Basically, there are two points. You must, uh, how should I say, make it short. Use some conjunctions. In IGCSE, reading and writing are mainly focused. Of course, speaking and listening are also included, but reading and writing are very important. So you must answer it in your own words. Number four, how has Richard's invention changed his life? Richard's invention changed his life. Thank you. How? Because of his invention, what benefits did he get? Uh, what is it? it uh, offer. Mm -hmm. Richard has been offered a scholarship. Scholarship. At? Uh, at one of Kaya's top school. Uh, to be an 
uh, to be an engineer mm. uh, and a pilot. Mm. Correct. So, his invention ch has changed his life because he has been offered, the last paragraph, offered a scholarship at <laughs> one of Kenya's top schools and you, you got, you got, you combine two ideas to be an engineer and a pilot. Got it? Do you know how to answer? Hey, you should write it down in your notebook, right? While teaching, you should write it down. Even if you have no time to write or just put dot dot dot, you must put bracket in the passage or you need to write how to change. The sentences. All right. So I will go to next point. That is grammar. Now see, use of English, the present perfect active and passive. Present perfect. First of all, I, I want to discuss present perfect. Present perfect form. Minity, the form of present perfect. Have plus plus three. Yes. Has have plus verb three. You must understand like that. Present perfect is has have plus verb three. Present perfect passive. By Gogyo. Mm, yes. Uh oh. Passive, passive. Oh, uh, Pyoti Ha Day. please attend the class regularly. Very soon you will have a mini test. And what are you going to take? Hmm? If you don't attend the class regularly, you won't catch up with the lesson. Okay, Ben, tell me, passive form. Uh, has been plus battery. Hmm. Has, have, plus, being plus but three that is passive okay so this time time to say read read use the present perfect uh use the present perfect for situation, situation continue uh, up to now Continuing up to now and for things that have happened but are not linked to a specific past. Specific past. Yes. Present perfect. Situations continuing up to now. Or for things that have happened. That is the key point. But are not linked to a specific past tense. So I'm using reactive form. The big problem. Uh, the big the big problem has been the lions, which is to reread. To reread has always enjoyed making things using old old household appliances. appliances. And machine. Mm -hmm. How about passive? Uh, Rich's idea has been adopted by farmers. Adopted. To adopted by. Farmer to brother their animals from predator. predators. Predators. My, many lions has been killed by farmers try, uh, trying to protect their animals. Their animals, yeah. So yeah, look at passive. Why do we use passive? Because look at, you want to focus on an animal thing, richest idea, not doer. So passive, has been adopted. Many lions, they are not doers in this case. Farmers are doers. So many lions have been killed. Right? So please do number five. Write this. Complete the sentences using the verbs in brackets. Remember to use the present perfect passive. Do it quickly. One to six.
Can I check? Yeah. Yes. I go view, read number one and two. All righteous inventions have been made from simple things and all appliance, appliances. Appliances. Yeah, make. So, uh, inventions, plural, have been made. How about number two? Your answer, please, quickly. Uh, Richard has been invited to speak about his invention at a conference in California. Yes, correct. Invited, right? Has been invited. And next one, thank you, Zin. Number three. Uh, he has been given a place at a toll high school in Kenya. Thank you, Zin. Has been what? Give or given? Given. Yeah, that's it. Okay, next. Key, number four. Oh, yes. Uh, the lion light have been Lights. welcome. Have been welcome. Welcome. Four. Four reading. Uh, by environmentalists, uh, because they are powered by solar energies and they produce wireless. Mm. Number five. Pose your jaw. The light us both the fire animals and the lion have been saved thanks to richer invention. Yes, have been saved. Correct. The next one, number six. Chuti Hatay. This crow have been protest from elephant by which is lying alive. Have been protected or protected? And protected. Mm. Have been protected. Everybody, passive. All the passive verbs must be ended with participle. Verb three, you know, invited, given, welcomed, saved, protected, made, like this. Okay. Um, let's do listening. Me teach you. Me. Let's do listening. This one. Habitat interactions. Um. Yeah, we have already discussed why rainforests are important, right? And now I will go to this. Listen and complete the fat file. Number two. Please read the questions before you listen. One to seven. You need to fit in the gaps. Read the questions quickly to get general idea. Read silently. That's why I am preparing. Track 16. Ready? Is the volume loud enough? Is it okay? Yeah. Can you make it a little bit louder? Louder? Wait. I will check. Mm 
Fine, Jackie. Tropical rainforest. Minari, are you okay? Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Yeah, land just right. cover about eight percent of the world's land surface. Track sixteen. Tropical rainforests cover about eight percent of the world's land surface. The largest of the tropical rainforest is the Amazon. There are rainforest areas in nine countries in South America. Why are tropical rainforests so important for life on Earth? Tropical rainforests are home to over 30 million types of plants and animals. 30 million? Just imagine. That's half of the Earth's wildlife and two-thirds of its plants. The plants provide food and shelter for the many animals that need the rainforest to survive. More than 25% of our modern medicines come from tropical forest plants. For example, the anti-malaria drug quinine is taken from a tree in the Amazon. And there are many more medicines yet to be discovered. Of course, a lot of the things we eat and drink every day come from the rainforest. Nuts, bananas, spices, coffee and chocolate. The rainforest also helps to control our climate. It is thought that the Amazon forests alone hold more than half the Earth's rainwater. The forest trees take up water from the forest floor and release it into the atmosphere where it becomes mist and clouds. We also depend on trees to keep the air clean. Trees take in the carbon dioxide we produce and give out the oxygen we need to breathe. And there are a lot more interesting facts about the rainforest. For example, did you know... Second time. This time, go to number three. Later, I will check and I will give you feedback. Number three, listen again and answer the questions. One to five. Read the questions quickly before you listen. Track 16. Tropical rainforests cover about 8% of the world's land surface. The largest of the tropical rainforest is the Amazon. There are rainforest areas in nine countries in South America. Why are tropical rainforests so important for life on Earth? Tropical rainforests are home to over 30 million types of plants and animals. 30 million? Just imagine. That's half of the Earth's wildlife and two-thirds of its plants. The plants provide food and shelter for the many animals that need the rainforest to survive. More than 25% of our modern medicines come from tropical forest plants. For example, the anti-malaria drug quinine is taken from a tree in the Amazon. And there are many more medicines yet to be discovered. 
Of course, a lot of the things we eat and drink every day come from the rainforest. Nuts, bananas, spices, coffee and chocolate. The rainforest also helps to control our climate. It is thought that the Amazon forests alone hold more than half the Earth's rainwater. The forest trees take up water from the forest floor and release it into the atmosphere where it becomes mist and clouds. We also depend on trees to keep the air clean. Trees take in the carbon dioxide we produce and give out the oxygen we need to breathe. And there are a lot more interesting facts about the rainforest. For example, did you know... Okay, start from gut feeling exercise. Number one, I go pure. Read number one. Uh, tropical rainforest cover uh, eight percent of the world's land surface. Yes, correct. Number one is eight percent. You only do at about eight percent, or just eight percent. Yeah, eight percent is okay. About eight percent is okay. All right. Is that answer is about eight percent? And next, number two. Ben, number two. Uh, the largest rainforest is the Amazon. Yes, how do you spell? A-M-E-Z-O-N. Yes. And next, number three. Key, number three. Hmm. Number three. Number three. Minity number three. All right. Um, thirty million of its wildlife and two third of its plant. Hmm. The first one is thirty. Million. Thirty million. And the second one is two third, two third of its plants. Okay, two third. Can you follow? Number four. Oh yeah, two third is how. Two third. Two by two by three, two thirds. Oh, three. And next number four. Some you say. Let me say number four. Hosey, I do number four. Hello. Who do you number four? And it's twenty five percent of our modern amazing came from the rainforest. Hmm. Twenty more than twenty five percent or yeah. 25%. And next, number five. Fine, group two. Uh, uh, food from the uh, rainforest includes nuts, bananas, and uh, spices, as uh, okay. coffee and chocolate. Yes, chocolate. And next, number six. Ben. Pen number six. Uh, the amazing ring, the amazing rainforest hold more than half of the air's rainwater. Yeah, more than half. Half. Minity seven. Yeah. 
Um, the trees in the rainforest keep the air clean by taking in carbon dioxide and right. producing oxygen we need to breathe. Yes, the first one is carbon dioxide. The second one is oxygen. Let's go to number three. How many countries in South America have rainforest areas? Let's start from that. Oh. For number one, number one, number three, number one, fine group you. How many countries? Nine countries. Nine, nine countries. Okay, next, number two. Why are plants important for the for the animals who live in the rainforest? Sam Jose. Hello. Jose Ajo. Why are plants important? Hmm? Key, key. Hello, hello. Yes, yeah, say number two. Why are plants important for the animals who live in the, in the rainforest? Uh, the plants is food for the animal. Wait. Ben, how about your answer for number two? Because? Uh, because, we, because we provide food and I think house shelter. or shelter. S-H-E-L-T-E, -E yeah, shelter. Yeah, it is sort of house. Shelter. For the many animals to live. Mm. Plants are important for the animals who live in the rainforest because they provide food and shelter. That is the main main reason. They provide food and shelter. Number three, where does the anti-malaria drug queening come from? Minity. Um, a tree in the Amazon. Say again. The answer is a tree in the Amazon. A tree in the Amazon. Oh, it comes, a, yeah. A, yeah, the, the tree is from Amazon, right? Not a, a tree. tree. A tree, only one tree. Yeah. Or the tree is from Amazon. Just a tree. The answer is called a bed. Or the trees? Yeah, only a tree. So which tree? Which tree? Well, in general, tree. it means, yeah, from the tree from Amazon, right? That is yeah. one. So number, number three is, the anti-malaria drug queening comes from the trees from Amazon. Okay, let's go to number four. Why is the rainforest important for medical research? Medical research. Um, ben. Uh, because the rainforest is uh, provides plans for it to create Medicine? Uh, no. Yeah. That, and that is the answer. Can you see? Where? Hmm? I, I have already paused. This one. Wait, I guess it. Huh? I, I have. Can you hear? 
Wait, wait. I haven't shared yet. Sorry. I... Actually, I am playing. I'm playing the script. Pull the anti malaria drug quin. The plants provide food and shelter for the many animals that need the rainforest to survive. More than 25% yeah, of our modern medicines come from tropical forest plants. Mm. So the question says, why is the rainforest important for medical research? Uh, wait, so more than 25% of our body, more than medicine came from tropical forest plants? Yeah. Comes from plants from the rainforest. I, I will repeat. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah, yeah, see. Minute is it. I thought the answer is going to be like there are more, that there are much more trees, and there are much more medicines to be discovered in the rainforest. Uh, that is not the main answer. It says, you know, more than 25% of modern medicine, modern medicine comes from plants, from the rainforest. And you, if you want to cover, if you want to put that point, it is also okay, but the, the key example, is the baby. For example, the anti-malaria drug quinine is taken that from is a tree just an in the Amazon. You cannot take all. And there are many more medicines yet to be discovered. There are more medicines to be discovered. So there are two main points. And one is more, more than 25% of modern medicines comes from the plants from the rainforest. There are more medicines to be discovered. You need to take both if you want to. But the key is, the, the important one is the first one. And next... Of course, a lot of the things we eat and drink every day come from the rainforest. Nuts, bananas, spices, coffee and chocolate. Okay, it's done. How about number five? Why do we often see mist and clouds above the rainforest? Who wants to answer? Yes. I care what about the forest floor and really is a small here. Mm. Can can you repeat? Can you repeat? Uh, I, yes. I didn't hear some part. Who is answering by the way? Show the other Okay. Show the other say. Take water from the forest floor and really is a small here. I forgot. I... Oh. Okay. Oh, yes. Okay. Let me check. Recording. Yeah, recording is okay. Okay. So, trees take up water from the forest floor and releases into the atmosphere. I will repeat. Trees take up water from the forest floor and it releases into the atmosphere, uh, sorry, and releases into the atmosphere. Oh, I, I'm not sure something. Sixteen. More than half the Earth's rainwater. The forest trees take up water from the forest floor and release it into the atmosphere. Hmm. Correct. Release it into the atmosphere. So you can take both. 
Trees take up water from the forest floor and release it. I L E S E. Okay, that's all. Any question? Uh, yes. Yes, see. Whether we listening in the mini test? <laughs> I haven't decided it yet. I will let you know. Don't okay. don't be. Yeah. It's all about writing. Uh, writing maybe writing maybe. Yeah, I haven't decided yet. <laughs> I will let you know. Just learn. I make you learn. That is just for oh, Ravisha. How much you can do? I want to know. That's also please learn grammar yeah, points and some vocabularies. Yeah. Actually, listening won't be that difficult. But in in the, um midterm test and final test, listening will be in, included. So mini test maybe. How can I practice my writing? Oh, writing. I won't go beyond beyond the lesson. Uh, beyond the lessons. So just practice. Uh, you have already prepared. You know, so far, I let, I let you, I let you do. Uh, I let you prepare for the, prepare for short talk. So, I let you write. Yeah, for those who who have no confidence, who have no, yeah, who have no confidence, and then through preparation for small talk, you can get uh writing practice, and I have taught you some topics like pros and cons of online learning, right? And another one is frame review. I have given you some sample answers, and through. The sample answers you can learn how to write. You know, I did. Uh, yeah. Yes. See, see, see. And could you mind? Would you mind um uh, checking my writings because I am I'm a little bit confused about some grammar rules. I'm not even sure I am correct or sometimes I, and past tense and present tense I'm mixed sometimes. So could you please check my writing? And I. Actually, you know, I could check the writing that I have given you and I could not reply at once because I have to check a lot of things from school as well as from, from this class. So it will take time. You can send some, but I could not, I could not check a lot. Yeah, of course. I just want to know my because grammar. I have to check yeah, writings from different classes. That is why. Yeah, I will check. I will check your yeah, writing assignments, writing assignments. And also, yeah, some, but not a lot. And and page number 60, 63. 63 is reading. I will do reading for, I will skip reading for a while and I will go to listening number seven. Listen to Amber and Sahara, that one. Doing their science homework, help them to complete the worksheet their teacher has given them, that one. Photosynthesis and aerobic respiration. Let's do another listening. I want you to read. Do you see that? Page 63, number 7. Yes. Okay. And read the, the questions. Uh, no, not questions, but read, read the whole test quickly.
Track 17. Do you get this stuff about photosynthesis and respiration? I think so. Okay, well, what happens when there's bright light? You mean when the sun's out? Yes. Well, there's more photosynthesis than respiration. Okay, so that means that carbon dioxide is taken in, right? Yes, that's right. And oxygen is given out. Right. So more oxygen than carbon dioxide is produced. Yes, that's right. What about when there's dim light? Well, when there's not much light, there is equal photosynthesis and respiration. So what does that mean? It means no gases are given out. In other words, oxygen and carbon dioxide aren't taken in or given out. OK, I think I get that. What about when it's dark? That's the opposite of when it's light. So there is respiration, but there's no photosynthesis. Oxygen is taken in and carbon dioxide is given out. Oh, I see. So at night, when it's dark, more carbon dioxide than oxygen is produced? Yes, that's it. OK, I think I'm beginning to understand it. Track okay, 17. second time, and I will check everything. Do you get this stuff about photosynthesis and respiration? I think so. OK, well, what happens when there's bright light? You mean when the sun's out? Yes. Well, there's more photosynthesis than respiration. OK, so that means that carbon dioxide is taken in, right? Yes, that's right. And oxygen is given out. So what is the answer for that? Given I will check off. It's given out. Oxygen <laughs> is given out. Right. So more oxygen than carbon dioxide is produced. How about next? It's produced. It's produced. It's produced. Yes, that's right. What about when there's dim light? Well, when there's not much light, there is equal photosynthesis and respiration. So what does that mean? It means no gases are given out. What is that? Given out. No, no, not given out only. Ah, given out because no gases. Yes. No gases are given out. In other words, oxygen and carbon dioxide aren't taken in or given out. How about next? Uh, taken in. And taken in and then? Ah, uh, given out. And taken in and given out and taken in and given out. Okay, I think I get that. What about when it's dark? That's the opposite of when it's light. So there is respiration, but there's no photosynthesis. Oxygen is taken in and carbon dioxide is given out. Oh. It, and next one, oxygen. Taken in. It's taken, it's in. taken in. It's taken in. How about carbon dioxide? It's given up. It's given, given up. It's given oh, up. I see. So at night, when it's dark, more carbon dioxide than oxygen is produced? Yes. How about next? It's produced. It's produced. It's produced. It's produced. It's produced. Yes. Oh, time is up. I will stop here. I will give you homework. What book? Page 46. Rainforest. Page 47. 46, 47. Yeah. 46, 47. Yes, all. And 49, number 5. And 50, 50 puzzle, yeah, crossword, 50, 51, yeah, don't do 51, do I need to repeat for 
homework, page 46, 47, 49 is number five, 50, number one. Any question? No. Okay, I will no. stop here. Bye-bye, everyone. See you. Bye-bye, sir. Bye-bye.